Good morning. Today is, is today Wednesday or Thursday? We don't, we don't know. <laughs> today is Thursday, <laughs> December 30th. Um, we have no idea what day. <laughs> we don't. We slept in again today. I know if you watched the last vlog, the ending was us uh, saying we were gonna rope drop. Yeah. Um, didn't happen. What time is it? It is 9:43. But this is our leisure trip, so it's we can leisure. sleep in. That's the key. that's <laughs> the key word of the, the trip. key word is leisure. leisure. So if you are over 21 and want to play a drinking game. Take a drink every time we say leisure on any of these vlogs. Um, anyway, so we are heading to Animal Kingdom right now. Um, the wait times are actually pretty short. It is a little chillier of a day and the sun's not out yet. So maybe that's more short. Yeah. It's a, <laughs> one day hour. Fog advisory. it's a fog advisory, but it's supposed to get up to like 80 something uh, today, yeah. 85. So we'll be fine. Um, to Animal Kingdom we go. Mom's favorite ride ever, dinosaurs, dinosaurs. there. It's only 15 minutes. So we can ride it over. And we can over. ride it over and over and over again. Right. Um, yeah, so we'll have lunch there and stuff, and we do have dinner tonight at Disney Springs Raglan Road. So yes. it's gonna be a fun day, a bunch of new things, and here we go. I also just want to point out how short the walk is from the bus. Our building is just around the corner, and we come this way, and this is the bus stop right here underneath the monorail where we get picked up. So it is a very very short walk probably about three minutes from our room to the bus stop um, and we're the, like technically one of the farthest buildings from the main um, entrance if you look at the map we're pretty far off to the side close to the transportation center but it's actually been the best building ever because we're such a short walk we're like last night if you watch the vlog we're like three minutes from the ticket and transportation center walking and we're like three minutes from the bus stop walking if you go the back way so I mean it's actually turned out to be the perfect building so we love Pagu Pagu made it to Animal Kingdom they have the Christmas tree up behind me and it's like the prettiest tree because it's got all the animals and stuff on it um, but we're headed in now I don't know where we're going first it is almost lunchtime so you know that'll be on the agenda I forget how like shaded this area is like how pretty and fascinating you feel like you're in the forest Yes, it is. It's birds everywhere. Yeah, there's little birds everywhere. There's waterfalls. I think our plan, we're gonna head to Dinosaur first and then maybe do Everest and then eat lunch. Um, we just wanna start with Dinosaur because, you know, to make mom happy. Because if we don't, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. <laughs> Look! There's Timon and Rafiki. Right with the tree of life. <laughs> Dad was so excited. Dad, who are you excited to see? Rafiki or? There's all these little fun little creatures. Ah! 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 Chase! Me and Chase! Look how cute. This little baby penguins almost got us there for a second. Heavens! Those are cute though. Those are fun. I guess they're here for Christmas. And then look at the little Timon and Pumbaa and um, Simba, little golden statues. But we are heading this way over towards Dinosaur. Mom, mom, how happy are you to be in Dino Land? You are probably the one that keeps Dino Land in business. I know. She loves it. That's her favorite land. Oh, are we gonna see Rafiki in them again? Oh, there's Donald. Uh oh, Dad's look, look at that. <laughs> he gets so excited to see the characters on the boat. That is the boat? Like more interesting to you than just seeing the regular character? Mm -hmm. Seeing Donald on the boat, he likes better, so. Okay, we have made it over to Dinosaur. It says it's a 65 minute wait, but it's worth it for mom. Every second. Plus the line is educational. So maybe we'll learn something. And I think we're gonna try to place our mobile order while we're in line, so that'll kill some time. But yeah, it really doesn't look that crazy. Like, I've seen it way worse than this. So, in we go. So 65 minutes is 10.48 when we got in line. Start your timers. Okay, so it is 11.12 and we are in the room. So how long of a wait was that? Like 50, like, uh, like 20 minutes. 25. 25 minutes, tough. So wow. it was posted 65 when we got in line, so. I think the wait times are being inflated a little bit, honey, just so people buy that lightning lane, so. We have experience every single time, at least 20 minutes less than the wait time posted. But let's go get that done. All right, here we go, here we go. Hey, we've survived dinosaur. Where's mom at? Mom, it's so fun. 
fun riding dinosaur with her because she giggles the entire time. Like that's all she's doing is like <laughs> every time you ride it, all you do is giggle the whole time. Like she's just so genuinely happy to be on dinosaur. It's it's funny. It's cute. It's so fun. Like when you haven't ridden it in a while and you get on it, it is really fun. Like it's. It whips you around a good bit, so. I say Dinosaur was a success. And it's only 11.20, so we might try to hop on Everest before lunch now. Yeah, we can. I think, that, I think we could do that. But the line for Everest goes all the way back to the bridge, which is the longest, the longest I've ever seen it. So this one might actually be a 65 minute wait. Um, we're gonna just look and peek and see how long Single Rider is, and possibly try to get on that. And if not, we're just gonna go eat. And that's okay too. So we got in single rider line. We've been in line for about 10 minutes. Um, we're almost to the front. That's the front right there. We just have one more little loop to do. So it's probably worth it because it, it looks like a 70 minute. Yeah. If not, yeah. if not more. We waited like 20 minutes for single rider, and I think we're all on the same car, just not together. So that works out good. Mom might have actually gone ahead of us, but we're about to get on now. So 20 minutes as opposed to 70. That's pretty good. That's good. Let's go. On the car ahead of us. Yeah. Yeah. You, rode up front. Front. you rode front row? And we were stuck up there. We did get stuck. I'm glad so I was wondering, I was like, oh my gosh, I wonder if anyone else was stuck. I saw Madison on my car. But no, I was up front. The front. It was fun though. It was really fun. We did get stuck for a little bit and it was nice. It was relaxing. Um, but now our we're gonna eat from hungry. Yeah, our flame tree barbecue reservation is ready. So we're gonna go find a table. Oh, that pull your hair. We're gonna go find a table and get settled and then eat lunch. That's perfect. We knocked out two rides within like an hour. Um, single rider was definitely the move on that one though. Okay, so we found us a table at Flame Tree Barbecue and we hit I'm here, prepare my order. Um, the thing about Disney is if you're eating at peak lunchtime, you can't be afraid to like be like, are y'all done? Like, and just we'd be like, no rush, but we're just gonna stand right next to you until you finish, <laughs> so we can get your seat. Um, Cause it's 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 pretty hardcore. Um, Madison had to steal a chair from a table. It's fine. We've made it. Almost as good a high chair. So yeah, we will check back in once we eat, get our food. How has everyone's Animal Kingdom day been so far? Great. Good. Good. We've done animal. We've done. Dinosaur and Everest, but all within like an hour and a half of being here. So now we're about to eat and then maybe we'll hit some shows. The food is here. I got the mac and cheese oh, with pulled pork, which looks good. That looks really good. He got like the half chicken and onion rings. We got a side of flies for me and Maddie to split. And mom got the barbecue sandwich with pulled pork. So we're gonna dig in. And we will let you know how it is. It's a little bit later. We devoured our food. Mine was so good. The mac and cheese was really good. Dad, how do you feel about yours? Good chicken. Chicken yeah. is really good. The skin on the chicken was really, really good. Mom? It was average. Yeah, mom's mom's looks pretty average. Like it just looks like a pulled pork, yeah. like yeah. normal. But dad's was really good. Um, and the mac and cheese is really good. But I know you can get the mac and cheese elsewhere throughout the park as like more of a snack option too. What is good mac and cheese? But it's very good mac and cheese. It's not as good as the Cellier sauce like, but it's <laughs> nothing will beat that. After much convincing, we have decided to do it's tough to be a bug. Um, we're gonna do it's tough to be a bug, and then I think we're gonna head back to the hotel. Um, and we're gonna get some drinks, which sounds fun. Mom has this really cool pina colada drink that she likes a lot. So get some fun drinks, and then we're gonna like just relax, maybe hang out by the pool, and then go to Disney Springs to shop, which will be really fun. So I think it's a good plan. I'm excited for it to be a bug. We haven't done it in a long time. 
And it's fun like when you go in a full theater, which it will be because it's busy, um, because people don't know what's gonna happen. And if you haven't done it yet, you have to do it. If we were bugs, what would we be? Mom would be a ladybug. Dad would be a stink bug. Yeah. Or a dung beetle. <laughs> what would I be? What was my insect? Uh, praying mantis. What's, why a praying mantis? A stink bug. A stink, I'm a stink bug. What would Madison be? Madison would be a roly poly. Yeah, that's what Madison would be. <laughs> okay, comment of the day. Comment down below what insect you would be. <laughs> if you were, it's tough to be a bug. Um, yeah, that's our weird comment of the day. What is he doing? What are you doing? Just looking. We got out of the tub to be a bug, and it was funny because the people who had never done it before were like screaming the whole time. But now we are headed back to the poly because we're gonna go have some drinks, just freshen up. We have a whole day at Animal Kingdom in like two or three days. So that's when we're gonna kinda hit the Lion King and Avatar. Uh, but we knocked out the really big rides that we wanted to do. And yeah, so we're heading back to the poly now. We're really getting our money's worth out of that hotel, let me tell you guys. But it's nice, I feel like more relaxed. Like the whole trip, just it actually feels like a vacation instead of like go, go, go. So, on to the Poly. So, we just got off the bus at the Polynesian. I just love this resort, it's just so great. We're heading inside the main um, ceremonial house, the great ceremonial house, to find us something to drink. And then we'll walk back to the room. Dad fell asleep on the bus. <laughs> he was like all the way, like, he was out to where, like, falling over. So I, I guess it's a good thing that we came back to the resort. So we're gonna find us something to drink. Madison's 21st birthday drink. Woo! First one of the trip. Took it easy the first couple days. Kicking off the end of the year, right? We're over at the Tambu Lounge, which is, Ohana's right to the side over there. It's just right there. And it's just a little bar outside of Ohana. They have a really, really extensive, like fun drink menu. Like all of these options. Okay. Mom and I got our pina coladas. They're huge. They look good. They look, they look good. They got a huge chunk of pineapple on top. And Madison's ordering. She wanted to show her ID and do all the things for her 21. So that's what she's doing. But this is about to be so good. I'm gonna try my pina colada now. I have a great view. I can literally, I'm sitting directly in front of Cinderella's castle in Main Street, but pina colada time. Oh, that's good. Good choice, Mom. Review. Is it good? Very good. And nothing for Dad. He's watching the football game, so. But there, I don't know if you can see it. Let me see if I can focus in on it. There's the Magic Kingdom right there. That's the castle. So, a very, very good view. And a very, very good drink. Madison getting her first drink. She's 21. What do you get, Madison? Hawaiian oh, Mule. The Hawaiian Mule, which is handmade vodka, citrus reduction, and ginger beer. Madison got the Hawaiian Mule. Yeah. She's gonna try it. We don't know if she's gonna like it or not. Oh, I like that. Do you actually? Yeah. It came, some wine. It came with an edible flower. I'm not gonna eat it. <laughs> Dad might. <laughs> Will you eat the edible flower? The edible flower? Oh yeah, you always eat that. <laughs> So we're just gonna sit here and drink. We have Magic Kingdom back there. We got the pool. We got some foliage, some foliage. That's the line down there for um, for the Dole Whips. It's pretty lengthy, so we're gonna enjoy our pina colada right here. We just finished up at the Tambu Lounge. It was very, very good. Um, I'm like pretty picky with my drinks, and that um, that was excellent. It didn't taste like. It was in a machine, like a frozen machine, my pina colada was, but it didn't taste like it. It tastes pretty natural. Madison really liked her Hawaiian mule too. She said it had a, bit, a little bit of spice to it. It does have like a citrusy flavor other than like another like classic we're mule does. The we're taking the stairs. So we're heading down back to the hotel now, um, to the room. We're gonna rest a little bit and then in a little bit, we're gonna go over to Disney Springs and do some shopping before dinner at Raglan Road which is something like we've never eaten at before. So, we are looking forward to it. I'm about to look at the menu now and like pre-decide what I'm gonna get. Does anyone else do that? 
decide what they're gonna get before they actually get to the restaurant. So comment down below if you're if you're one of us or if you like to go to the restaurant and decide there. We are not those people. Hello. We are back. It's a little bit later now. It is 540. Um, we just relaxed. We had our drinks. We went back to the room. We hung out. And now we are heading to Disney Springs. We're going to shop around a little bit. And we have dinner at Reglan Road, which we've never eaten at before. But it's an Irish pub style kind of thing. So we're going to walk down to the bus. So here's our house. This is like right outside of our room. These are the stairs. And we go right down that way to the bus stop. It's like a three minute walk. We're just waiting on our family now. And then head to Disney Springs. We haven't been to Disney Springs, Dad, in how long? Like a long right. time, like five or six years at least. So, first time back. There is nothing like the Sprint when you see the bus <laughs> that you're trying to get on. I mean, we saw it pull up and we were like, Madison, go and see if it's Disney Springs. And she took off and it was. And then we all started taking off. But now we're all here, heading to Disney Springs. <laughs> Madison's kind of prep. You just, you never know how much time's gonna be in between and we're ready to get to the, our place. So, ran so and of course, Madison couldn't see over the road. Yeah, Madison could <laughs> see over. Like, it was, it was some a race. Lady, some lady drop. Yeah, it was just money. I had to think about her. But we made it. We made it. So we have made it into Disney Springs. I forgot how massive this place is. Like just like pulling up to it, there's so much, but it's so pretty with all the lights and stuff. I feel like I'm in like a luxury, I don't know, I'm just excited about it. It looks beautiful. And we're gonna hit some shops. It is six o'clock, we've got dinner at eight, so we have two hours to shop around, hang out, have a good time. So Gideon's is the place here with the famous cookies. And you have to get in line, you have to get in line to put your name on the list to join the virtual line. So we just put our name down. It's a two hour, 35 30. minutes. That's and that's, you, right you get your name and then you get into that line to get into it, to get your cookie. So it's gonna be perfect. We'll time it right around dinner. So that'll be good. Two hour and 30 minute wait. So we've made it around. We're going into Disney style now to take a peek at what they got Disney style was. And then we're gonna go in the Star Wars shop. This place is for the Disney lover. Like, look at this jacket. Look at these jackets, wow. These are so soft. $64.99 for this. I mean, it's all Disney stuff. Like it is, it is here. These ears are kind of grunge. Look at this, some leather ears. Okay, heading in Star, Star Wars Galactic Outpost to see what else they have that's not in the park. They have some like different kind of, like I like, yeah. Fed up. <laughs> I know, that's cool. I like it. <laughs> they have a lot of Boba Fett stuff. Well, we just, this show just dropped last night. Yeah, so that's probably what. There's a lot out now for Boba Fett. Our table is ready at Raglan Road. We got some music over here and we are about to head on in and get some food. We're hungry, so this will be good. Okay, so we just got sat at Raglan Road. We're actually right next to the stage. It's right there. And they said there's like live performers, dancers, singers. So the menu is really big. So we're gonna look over that and then decide and we'll let you know what we get. So we just got a performance going on. We got some bread going on. We just ordered. So far, so good. back here but Madison and I got a Bailey's shake alcoholic of course Madison come oh, on wait. try it the Bailey's shake, the Bailey's shake. Come on, Madison's gonna try it so it's got ice cream Bailey's obviously it looks like that's chocolate syrup <laughs> Dad got the, what'd you, what'd you get? Rice. The worth the wait sandwich. Mom got steak. Madison got the braised beef. It smells so good. And I got the burger. And we got some music. We are going to dig in and we'll let you guys know how it is. Okay, so we just got out of Raglan Road. I think everyone really liked it. Oh my God. I think everyone's food was really good. The show was that good. Was great. In total for all of us, we got four meals, four drinks, and a dessert. And it was and $1.59. Uh -huh. 
And our waiter, Jonathan, was incredible. And not a single drink ever went, like... Drinks were never dry. Yeah, he cleared the table. I mean, it was good. And the performances were good. I oh, they were amazing. It was good. Fun. It was fun. We had a good time, so definitely recommend. It's something we never would have tried, but Madison booked it, okay. and it was good. So now we're going to Gideon's. We were in line, in the virtual line, for three hours, and it's finally our time. We're full, but we're gonna make room for a cookie because these are supposed to be like the best cookies ever. Hey, we're inside Gideon's. Oh my god, it smells oh like Oh my gosh. Oh no. It smells, I wish there was smell vision so y'all could smell how incredible it smells in here. Oh my god. I don't know what we're gonna get. I, every, he's right. The, the guy told us like once you come in here, all your ideas what you want goes out the door. This is it. Oh, I'm so excited. So we just came out of Gideon. We got a lot. Um, we're gonna wait till we get back to the hotel to show y'all all what we got, but like get excited because the smell is walking in there. But, yeah. Oh my god. So we're we're walking back to the bus stops now. We're gonna go to the hotel. We're gonna get some milk there because we figured it'd be cheaper than getting it here because um, it was kind of expensive for like a little thing of milk here. Um, so yeah, and then we're gonna show you the cookies and stuff when we get back. And I can't wait. I'm s I'm ready. It's a little while later. We've made it back. We picked up our milk from Captain Cooks. Is that right? Yes. Captain Cooks. Um, and we're about to eat our cookies. I'm about to try Gideon's chocolate chunk cookie. I heated mine up a little bit because it's been a while. I don't even know where to bite. Oh my god. That is worth a four hour wait. Oh my goodness. Is if you, good? Yes. If you like chocolate, in my mouth. If you like chocolate, get that. If you're not a chocolate fan, don't get it. The whole place smells like chocolate. So. Mm -hmm. Madison got a slice well. of cake. While they, yeah, while they got their cookies, I got me a cake. What flavor is it? It's salted caramel with a chocolate cake. So with the cakes, whatever's in the display is the types of cake they have. They change day. every day. So they change it up. So. But the slice is huge. Look at this. Hold on, let me, let me unveil it first. I'm like, okay, hold on. It's kind of... Whoa. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So that's one slice right there, which is crazy. I think this was like, hold on, how much is it? They gave us these cute little menus. They said the December ones. You got a naughty and nice one. How much was how much was the cake? Uh, let's see. Where's the cake? Oh my god. Okay, uh, you know what? It doesn't say. It doesn't say. Six dollars for the cookie that I got, which was massive that you could split easily. And I think maybe six to nine for the cake as well. We shall yeah, try it out. Here she goes. Okay. T taste test. Salted caramel cake from Gideon's. That looks so good. Pray that, man. It's pretty yeah. good. It's pretty good. Oh my gosh. I want one more bite. It is. It's just the right amount of salted caramel. And it looks like there's a lot of icing, but the icing is not super sweet. It's like that good little balance. Okay, well that's gonna do it for today's vlog. We're gonna chow down. Thank you guys for watching. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow's New Year's Eve. We're going to Epcot. Dinner at Beer Garden. So comment down below and subscribe to see that video next week. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys for watching. See you tomorrow.